Okay, we are gonna take a look at Advanced Legends. We got a Charlotte Night Race. This is on the new Charlotte. Not a whole lot has changed other than the grass is now AstroTurf. But we're gonna see if we can get a clean race here. See what it's like. We got two Bradys on the front. Kenny Brady in the number one car and Brenda Brady in the number five car. So getting ready to go green this time through three and four. Green flag, green flag. We are green. Brady gets a good jump in the five car. Everyone in the top six gets through pretty clean. Too wide back here for the fifth spot. That is the nine of Donovan Strauss getting past the six of Aaron Ariga. Seven car of Russo gets a little loose, loses a position. Going to look back inside, block the six from entering low. Back up front, though, we got Brady chasing Brady. Brenda Brady with Kenny Brady right on her tail. In third place, Adam Purcell. He is in that number two car. Strauss up to that fourth position and Russo in fifth. So, 40 laps. We've got 37 left. Gonna get into lap traffic. Looks like the three car had issues, maybe a little damage on it. And uh, it's gonna be the first one to come up on getting lapped. Blink there by Strauss as he's working around the two car. Kenny Brady pulling away now, took the lead. Another move to the outside by the nine. Looking out there, trying to get a run on the two out of the corner. Maybe a little bump through the center. Gets the nose just under the rear. Is he going to? Try to make a stick underneath. He does with a little help from the seven car. We've got a lap car spun. That's a three car taken out. The number six, I believe. No. Uh, number two car is who got involved in that. So, lap car is starting to become a factor. No yellows here in the lower class divisions. So, Kenny Brady and Brenda Brady. Donovan Strauss in the nine. Carter Russo in the seven. Ariga in the six. And Brad Homer is now up to six in the 11 car. Take a look up front. We've got a blinking three car and a couple of lapped cars. That's the 14 of Pacheco. He's gonna try to work under the blinking three Gets a little loose off the corner. One car is going to go around the outside. More blinking from the three car. So Brady and Brady working their way through. Both of them getting past the three car. Now looking to get past the 12 who stays high. Always a danger, though, when the lap car goes up high and enters too hot, hitting the outside and then spinning down across. So, pretty much even through traffic. Strauss in the 9, a little farther back. Unfortunately, don't have gaps in the standings right now for some reason, so can't get those to you. But as you can see, about a straightaway. Last time by, let's take a look at the lap times. Now that they've had a clean lap, we got a 343 out of Kenny Brady and a 303 out of Brenda Brady. So a little quicker for the second place car. Next car to be lapped is the two car. And some more blinking. Looks like I'm having a bit of connection issue with the server. That's 
last time by Kenny Brady was quicker. This time by Brenda Brady's quicker. 16 down, 24 to go. Leader checks up because lap car checks up. We got some bumping and banging now out of turn two. That might open the door for Brenda Brady. We're going to focus on these two as this is the battle for the lead coming to halfway. Now, will the two car pull up out of the way? He does. That's going to allow the leader by. Second place is going to have a little tougher time getting by as they're coming out of the corner. While all that was happening, the nine car Strauss does get caught up a bit more. He's going to go to the outside of the lap car and he will get let by there. So it's closed in, but overdrives the corner on the entry of one. That's going to lose some time and is going to have to get around that lap car number 10. So they have now lapped up to 8th place in this 14 car race. Kenny Brady pulling out to a larger lead now over the 5 car. Next car to be lapped to go lap down is the 4 car in 7th place. That's Derek Trowbridge. But there's a couple of people that are already lapped in between him and the leader. So Brady's got a couple of lap cars, gets past one, once again Brenda Brady catching him out of the corner, it's going to hurt her getting up to speed, and Kenny Brady once again gets entry of corner pass, and Brenda stuck with the exit of the corner. Go inside with the second place car. Closing in just a bit, being able to stay a little bit lower through three and four. And that time about a tenth and a half quicker than the leader. With just 14 to go, really closing in now that they've got some clean track. Dead even that time around on lap time. So, it looks closer from in-car, still about five car lengths in between first and second. Strauss not being much of a factor, about a tenth off of the front two. Now that four car is the next car in front of the leaders. Ten to go now. Take a look through the field. In third, behind the Bradys, is Donovan Strauss. In fourth, and it looks like they just hit the wall, is Carter Russo. Brad Holmer in the 11 car is fifth, and Derek Trowbridge is in the sixth position. And that is your lead lap cars in this fairly clean Advanced Legends race. Once again, getting around the 12 car on entry. We got a spun car that is the three, once again having issues on the track. And because of all this, we've got a battle for the lead with seven to go as Brenda Brady is up to the rear bumper of Kenny Brady, about a car length off. And there is 
four lap cars ahead of them going through one and two. It's going to come down to speed and traffic management. The 10 pulls out of the way of both of them, allowing Kenny Brady and Brenda Brady through. Five to go now. This time by Kenny Brady runs a 405. Brenda runs a 404. Dead even on lap times. Now Kenny blocks the inside line very early. Not sure if he got loose or how he ended up down there, but definitely hurt his lap time. Four car having a little push out of the corner, trying to get around the 13. Not really looking behind. Leaders are on top of each other as the four car works his way under the 13. Is he going to allow the leaders to go by? He does pull up out of the way. That allows Kenny by. Brenda's going to have to work her way out of the corner. Loses time due to that. But instantly right back up on the rear bumper. We're on the last lap now. Is there going to be a bump? Tried to go in deep. Does not work. Kenny Brady dominates this one as Brenda Brady finishes second. Donovan Strauss farther behind in third in that nine car. Carter Russo was up there in the mix for the third spot. A couple of hits. Drops him way back in the fourth spot. And the 11 car, Brad Homer, finishes fifth, last car on the lead lap. So, decent race, clean racing. Kenny Brady with an I rating of 5,749. Gonna take the win as the Bradys do a little spinning out there after the race is over, celebrating their 1 2. So, hope you enjoyed that. And. Uh, we will come back for some more broadcasts, randomly selecting what looks interesting to watch. Thanks for watching.